What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Valtronic Designs. To my left here is quite possibly the best car ever. There is really no way that you can get close to this car unless you have a twin turbo performante or something like it. McLaren 720S is the ultimate platform for tune, aftermarket mods, if you want to do exhaust or downpipes or anything and make this car even faster than it is, which is rather ridiculous because it is already so fast and so capable. The problem is, is although these cars sound better than the 570S and the MP4-12C, it doesn't have that raw F1 high pitch exotic sound flavor that we assimilate to cars like the Ferrari 458 and some of the other Ferraris that are out there that have captured our hearts. To me and the Valve Trunk Design's mission, what's so important about the driving experience for a vehicle like this is the sound. The car can be really fast, but if you don't have that really enticing F1 sound characteristics, it doesn't make the car super engaging to drive at low speeds. Behind me, we have two different exhaust configurations. We've got the factory McLaren sports exhaust, which was fitted on this vehicle. Then on the right, we have something that myself and the entire Valtronic Designs team is extremely proud of. This is our F1 race package for the McLaren 720S. It is completely unique to anything else that's on the market and promises to provide the ultimate F1 sound experience. In this video today, I'm gonna to talk you guys through why this is such a revolutionary development for the 720S platform. I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit about the pitfalls of this factory exhaust. Then we're gonna start the car up. We're gonna do some revs. We're gonna do flybys. We're gonna do hard accelerations, launch control, and we're gonna put the car in as many scenarios as possible so that you guys understand what the F1 race package does to the 720S McLaren. This car is absolutely flawless, except for the exhaust sound. So we crank the engagement up to 11. This car behind me still has the OEM downpipes. So if your car is McLaren CPO, like this car is, and you don't want to tune or modify, you can do this exhaust configuration, not have any problems with warranty, and have a much more exotic F1 sound characteristics, which I think fits the character of the vehicle far better. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. I'm gonna talk a little bit about the systems. We're gonna show you all the sound characteristics. It's gonna be a little bit of a longer video, but we're so excited to announce this F1 platform for the car. Let's get to it. So why is this exhaust so special? You'll see, this is the factory McLaren Sports exhaust. It's just three inches. It's basically a straight bypass and there's no valves or anything. Obviously, the exhaust is just gonna come straight out and not having any crossover induces two things. The first is the car is actually a little bit droney, even in a stock configuration with stock downpipes. Seventh gear, 60 miles an hour, you get this kind of unwanted bassy frequency, which is not very engaging. And then the other problem is not having any crossovers, the sound is very flat. For a vehicle like this, you know, as spectacular as it looks, the sound quality just isn't there. So on this system here, you'll see it has two X pipes. And the reason for this is because with these two X pipes, we're forcing the exhaust gases to scavenge properly. And because these X pipes have been designed with the correct cross section to get as much optimization in that area as possible, the best flow, but also really increase the velocity. And honestly, it kind of works like a garden hose. When you put your finger over it, if it's the same amount of volume that has to go through a smaller space, the velocity is going to increase. So, but obviously we don't want to increase the back pressure. This system flows really well. It's just a straight piece of pipe. Of course it does. So for your applications where the cars are eight, 9,000 wheel horsepower, this system is still gonna flow extremely well, but give you that really exotic sound. So you can combine it with the stock downpipes like you're gonna see in this video today on this car, or if you're gonna do turbos or what and try to chase the really high horsepower, this configuration is still gonna give you the flow and the dynamics that you need and of course that F1 sound. Additionally as well, it's all titanium, so it's extremely light. Stock McLaren 720S sports exhaust here. And the weight is 16 and a half pounds. And then the titanium double X pipe F1 setup is only about 11 pounds. So saving some weight, which is good. We always like that. And of course, we're all about aesthetics here at Valtronic. That's why the system looks extremely beautiful. But at the rear of the car, you can see we've got these really badass single wall titanium four inch exhaust tips. And when you're driving behind the car, you can actually see the X-pipe configuration through this kind of um, 
uh, hexagon perforated shield here. So you get a really nice look at the rear of the car with these tips. And we also find that the tips help accentuate the flames because they're more round and you get more of the blast cannon effect when this car shoots some gnarly flames, which you'll see in this clip right here. You can see the car is holding that hot blue flame, which is just such a badass thing to see. These cars have a rear view camera right here and you can actually see the flames as you accelerate in the rear view camera. That's why this sound configuration we're so excited for is because our goal is to offer the ultimate experience. And if you purchased a vehicle like this and don't have the best sound setup, you're really sacrificing your engagement. We understand the system is very expensive, but if you've worked so hard to own this vehicle, it makes sense to have the best sound so that you can have the best engagement. inside the 720S here. From factory, obviously we've explained that the exhaust is rather lackluster, although it's basically a straight pipe, if you have the sports exhaust. This improves upon the sports exhaust, and if you don't have the sports exhaust, this upgrade, it's gonna feel even more enticing. The thing is with this setup is, you don't get any drone, and you're gonna see in the next video we do with this same setup with the free flow down pipes, you also don't get any drone. Obviously we're Valvetronic, we're known for exhaust valves, but when you do the perfect engineering when it comes to developing this type of exhaust configuration, you actually don't need a muffler and you don't need valves to get the car to have incredible F1 sound and no drone and an enjoyable sound frequency when needed. This platform, we're really chasing that exotic F1 sound and that's definitely what we've been able to deliver upon. 44 miles an hour, seventh gear, you don't get like the uh, base that you got from the factory exhaust. We'll give you some more sound flavors. I'm actually gonna lower the rear window, which is the best thing ever. You have a roadster or a spider. This exhaust too, in the lower RPMs, you still get a nice amount of drama, so you don't have to drive the car so fast to get the experience. Especially in first, as you come off throttle, come down in the RPM range, you get a nice overrun crack, which is very fun. Hear those there.
Mm-hmm. <laughs>